It turns out that most people don't truly know the real Kate Middleton. Though Meghan Markle branded the Princess of Wales as formal and Harry and Meghan, royal biographer Robert Jobson thinks the future queen has a side to her the public doesn't get to see. I think she's not overly gushing. I think that she's a lot more fun than the image that is presented, Jobson told an outlet. The image that's presented is a bit of an enigma, I think, but she's a lot more fun, he said, adding, as he doesn't really like to let her guard down. While attending public engagements, the mom of three is often spotted giggling with onlookers in her family, but she never steps out of line. She laughs a lot and I think anybody who laughs a lot is obviously somebody who's got that sense of humor and someone's one with themselves, and I think she certainly is that, Jobson explained. Someone said to me that she's somebody that always seems to bring her A-game to the table, the expert concluded. So that's the sort of difference, she's a class act, I think. In Harry and Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex discussed her first impression and awkward introduction to Kate and Prince William. I was a hugger and have always been a hugger. I didn't realize that that was really jarring for a lot of Brits, Meghan shared, referring to when she met the Waleses. I guess I started to understand very quickly that the formality on the outside carried through on the inside. There is a forward-facing way of being, and then you close the door and you are like, oh, great. We can relax now. But that formality carries over on both sides. And that was surprising to me, the suit star admitted. Although Kate has a jovial personality, the princess is keeping a low profile as she battles cancer and is focusing her energy on her health and three kids, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. There is still nothing in her diary. My understanding is that people are going to have to get used to seeing a lot less of Kate, a source told an outlet. The priority for her now is going to be family and the children. The youngest of those kids, Louis, is only six. Like a lot of people who have a brush with mortality, Kate is going to prioritize the things that matter to her from now on. In her case, that means her kids, they added. Kate took six months away from the spotlight due to her diagnosis, but the future queen returned to duties at Trooping the Color. It's a very good sign that we've seen Kate twice in recent weeks, first of all at Trooping the Color and then Wimbledon, so clearly she's a lot better, expert Phil Dampier told an outlet at the time. It indicates that she is clearly on the mend, and hopefully she'll be back in action in a month or so, in the autumn, Dampier added. You know we can expect to see her start to gradually, slowly do some public engagements, but, as I said earlier, it will totally depend on the medical advice. The Sun spoke to Jobson.